Okay, so I'm back with another booze review whether you asked for it or not. <laughs> um, I'm done with this fucking mixed drink shit. I only had two in my fridge, so now I'm on to my actual hard liquor. I'm gonna start this bitch off with something fruity, which is my preferred palate for alcohol. Parrot Bay Pineapple Rum. So, white rum. I have a feeling someone cut my fucking booze because I put this shit in the freezer and it got fucking slushy. So now it's taking up room in my actual refrigerator. A little fucking hesitant to do a shot of this one because I have a bad experience with shots of fucking rum. Not with vodka, not with whiskey, not with really anything else I've ever had. Just rum. But it's been spiced rum, so... Hopefully this goes down smoother than I feel like it's going to. It's a nice old 21%. The highest percentage so far, considering they were mixed drinks, so of course they're significantly lower. You can't smell the booze, really. It smells a little rancid for some reason. And like gummy worms. Like old gummy worms. I kind of dig it. Excuse my fucking vomit if that happens after this. <sighs> Honestly, not as bad as I was thinking it'd be. A little bit of an aftertaste. Not as bad as some rums. I honestly really prefer Parrot Bay for the fruity rums. I don't like any of that other cheaper bullshit. Honestly, couldn't. At this price point, I have to fucking look something up. I feel like it's probably about 14, 15 bucks, probably what I spent for it at Hy-Vee. It's been so fucking long though. Parrot Bay, pine, apple. Let's. $13.99, TotalWine.com. You know what? I'll just trust you, Total Wine, and assume that sounds correct to me. Which isn't bad. I love this shit with green tea. Oh, fuck, bitch. This and green tea. This adds, like, the perfect amount of fucking flavor to, like, an unsweetened green tea. And it's got just enough fucking sugar in it. I'm sure it's still not good for you, though. I mean, it's fucking alcohol. Yeah, I'm shooting these all at the same time, so yeah, I'm kind of getting a little fucking drunk right now. But it's fine, because I've been feeling like shit the last four days, so I don't really care. <laughs> you can call me an alcoholic, that's fine. I might be, who knows, but I just spent the last, like, eight months not- Not eight months. Actually, almost eight months, since I started my new job. It's been about eight months since I really drank more than one drink a week, so... Uh. Oh, fuck. It's pretty solid. It goes down really smooth. You can mix it with just about anything. You could probably even put it to like some coke or some shit considering they make that orange coke now and that's pretty fucking good in my opinion. That would- pineapple coke? Worth a fucking shot, you know? Obviously, shit, pour me a fucking glass of it, I'd drink it. Solid. Real solid. It mixed with just about anything, quite frankly. So you want a really versatile, fruity drink that you can really put in about anything, and I'm sure you can use it in a lot of different cocktail recipes. I trust Parrot Bay. I trust Parrot Bay with my life. <laughs> there's that one. Just to reiterate, 21% alcohol. Good with tea, juices, Kool-Aid, you know, Sprite-like drinks, you know, any of the Fantas would probably be pretty good. Even some Coke if I'm taking a chance here. Not the kind, but you know. Solid, solid rum. 